Hello Media Protocol community, it's James, you're the lovely CEO, I'm over in Afrobytes in Paris and I'm here with Samson from Accents. Now Samson is running an awesome project which is to do with supply chain, do you want to talk to us about Accents? Absolutely, thank you for the introduction. Um, hi community, uh, we are in the process of our ICO, uh, we have a project which essentially will be servicing trade finance for underserved uh, small and medium enterprises within emerging market countries uh, as well as providing a look-through and traceable supply chain management system. So Samson, with Accents, you're building this amazing way of actually bringing finance to small and medium enterprises, small businesses. What are the kind of problems that these people like uh, store owners or small manufacturers or small uh, retailers, what are the kind of things they face and that you're addressing? Absolutely. Excellent question, by the way. Um, we actually come from a background of, of trade finance and commodities trading, so we have experienced firsthand the issues that, uh, that occur in these, uh, in these regions. Primarily, um, we have over 50% of African and certain Asian region SMEs which are underserved by banks, um, either because they just don't have the traditional credit parameters in terms of approaching financial institutions, or they're too over leveraged in terms of accessing additional capital. What we want to do is come in and provide that last mile of financing when there's a finished product uh, through a blockchain um, technology whereby we have control of the supply chain process and therefore can look at some non-traditional parameters such as the pure transactional framework more than in the balance sheet of the companies in terms of providing them with capital but also have control of the product as collateral. And this has been uh, feasible uh, of late thanks to the advent of blockchain and how we can trace and make it transparent and have one place of truth whereby all documentation and all the stakeholders can communicate and approve certain documents and so forth, making it tamper-proof and very transparent. And one thing I love about this, and this is something, guys, that I've expressed so much when we're talking about Media Protocol. Media Protocol is a business that's trying to change the way that the internet functions and to use blockchain to do it. It's not just because blockchain. We're actually trying to solve real problems. And this is what's great about pro projects like Accents, taking real life real life problems, real life challenges, and using this amazing decentralized technology to change the way the world works. People are gonna carry on doing what they're doing, they're gonna find it easier to raise finance, they're gonna find it easier to run their business, they're gonna find it easier to compete, to grow, to give you better services. But blockchain is the mechanism that allows that to happen. They don't actually have to change much of what they're doing, they just get a proper, real respect for what is happening. So it allows everyone to get to crypto without having to understand and say what. Absolutely. And then what we look at is in terms of the key advantages is the velocity in terms of the deals, the transparency you get through the deals, and the ability to have that trust uh, being on, on, a, on a blockchain whereby each node, which will be each stakeholder within the value chain process, is able to look, certify, and be able to move across the different nodes um, swiftly and transparent. Awesome. Well, it's been an absolute pleasure. Great Thank hanging out you. here at Afrobytes. And actually, you don't want to see my t-shirt. Satoshi is African. Absolutely. And you guys got a great CEO over here who has been very generous in terms of uh, providing his advice. And uh, we look for his project to kick ass going forward. Play access. Cheers, guys. Have a great weekend.